there any dismissal papers to everything? Well, we'll, we'll take your papers and decide whether to dismiss something. Uh, you have to have evidence of things there, Jeff. Okay. And here's the proof of the... Are you dropping these off for Jonathan? Yeah. He Is told this me. our copy for him? Is that our copy for him? You can make a copy and give it back to me if you have to. We're not going to tell you. Just give them back. Take them to court when you're hearing scheduled. I'm not having a hearing. There's yeah, no yeah, reason to have a going, hearing. Going out of here. He told me to bring going, it back. On out of here. Hey, don't touch me. On out. Don't touch me. On out. You know what's funny is uh, Rachel Chipolotti down in on, Kanawha on County. Out, I'm shutting the she door. She will be a witness, and I'm going to bring up your write-up I did to her and have her answer on the record okay. how you can violate 3.8A. You okay. admitted. How do you... Back. Oh, who he doesn't want to be, America. He doesn't want to be confronted with. Why do you admit openly no, admit that, right now? You admitted it on the record. Special kind of. Three point eight A. A prosecutor shall never press charges on a person without probable cause. You admitted on we the had record. We probable cause. To there was no you evidence. A crime and you said when, there was no evidence. No, you can take this to court. Now okay? you're trying to take my evidence from me. No, I, you brought it here for me, sir. Yeah. What are you going to do with it if I give it to you? Are you going to put it on the I'll record? I'll put it in the file Actually, for your case. Jonathan is waiting on him to show up over Main Street. Okay. I, I just talked to him about that. For okay. what? What? Jonathan, he told he me to Jonathan, bring it back. Jonathan is at his office at Magistrate. Am I allowed to go up there? Or You're is, allowed uh, to go there to give him this. How do we press but a if criminal... You if you show your normal behavior, normal behavior, then you'll probably get arrested. Well, what's the definition of normal? normal Everybody for has their own normal. Normal different than normal. Everybody has their own definitions. Okay. And you go, know, go on, Zach. it's go, funny, go West on, Virginia go on your way. Hey, hey, he just go touched me. Way. It's assault. Yeah. I don't want you okay. touching me. Okay, then leave. How would, or what are you going to do? Would you like to come we'll down uh, to Kanawha County when I question Rachel on the record about you violating 3.8A? Yeah, you know, he's a punk, America. He was a, he was a special education member of the West Virginia. Uh, he's trying to push me up in there. I don't believe it. I'm dropping them off. Last time I went in there, they called it trespassing. And because the judge is trespassing my civil rights of public and speaking. Oh, what time's he coming back? He cannot push me out of here. What time is John coming back down here? Is he scheduled? Is John scheduled that, down here? Jonathan, I've told you, Jonathan is waiting for you. If I go in there, you'll try to arrest me. I don't trust nothing no, you no. do. Uh, what's going to happen is you're going to get arrested if you come back in here. For what? Okay. For what? For Public? trespassing because I've asked you to leave. You don't okay. own this building, do you? You I own hold it? the office. Well, then well, you're right. going to arrest me if I go in there. If walk in with me. In walk in with me out there. Way. Will you walk in with me? Because you'll try to arrest me if I enter there. I don't have the power of arrest. He told me between 9 and 1, come down here. He's not here. He's at the office at Magistrate Court because he's in court. If you I guess. want to drop that off to him, that's where he's at. If you do not engage in any illegal behavior there, what you illegal be behavior have I ever been convicted of, Jeff? See, he's trying to you do a con artist okay. too. They try to paint you as if bad you come people. Back in here, you're going to get arrested. Okay. What you have I ever done bad? Office. What have I ever been convicted I don't know of? Where please. To start with that, Zach. What have I ever but been convicted of? Ahead, see, see, there, there, there's nowhere to start because it's not true. See, he's, he's a con artist. Read the definition of con artist. It will be below this video right here. Con artist. He is trying to paint me out, make me look like a bad person. If you read the Times West Virginia newspaper bullshit scenario, he was trying to make it out to be that I need all this mental help and that they could put me away and save West Virginia, the lawsuit where I was beat in jail with uh, four damaged bones. And they thought that they would try to put me away for 16 years. He attempted to put me away for 16 years. He violated the crimes of holding me hostage and kidnapping. He did all that and admitted on the record in 16F-137 that there was no evidence. If there's no evidence, what the fuck were you doing holding me in jail for for 14 months? And the lawsuit against the state of West Virginia was dismissed with prejudice where that means you can't even reopen it. And that's why Keith White's case is at Supreme Court right now, the Pleasant County case. 
which is uh, 19C15. Jeff told me to come up here and give John this. Yeah. All right, he's in court right now, so just hang out. And I'll take him out and give that. All right. If you make copies of it and give it back to me. No, just wait till John comes in. I'll, I'll just leave. If, huh? I mean, and I can go home if you make copies and you know, ask the clerk to make. She can put it, maybe scan it in that charge. And then I'll take him back and... Are you supposed to do anything with John? No, and they just told me to bring him up and give it to him. He's supposed to write dismissals to everything because I've proved innocence. And all six of those road tickets can be flushed down the toilet. But uh, 19C15 was the Keith White case. He stole $7,500 from me, grand larceny. Went and shut it down, the lawsuit against the state of West Virginia, and I was arrested the day before they had to respond. And now I am going after Keith White's insurance company and wanting them to pay the same price West Virginia would. Since down in Kanawha County, where I was yesterday, Probably threatened to sanction Keith White if he pursued the case. Went and dismissed with prejudice without my consent, without me even knowing what had happened. And I was in jail and could not appeal it. He filed it in the wrong courthouse. It was a federal issue, not a state issue. And he went to the WVU compound, just keep that in mind. Yeah, I'll take the original. Hey, there he is. Hey, John, he's got your copies. Uh, so funny. when will you have the dismissal ones ready, John? Do you fax them down, or is that my job? Hey, hey John, do, do I fax them down to Charleston, or you fax them down to the DMV? All the dismissals since I've proved innocent on everything. Proved innocent on what? What you got in your hand right there. You heard the woman on the phone yesterday said my vehicle was registered. And, and when I was in Kanawha County you. yesterday, I got it. Proof of it. So now you have proof that I am not guilty. And you can file a dismissal. We'll see. We'll see. You're seeing it now. Do you have vision impairments that you need an evaluation for? I'll make a copy of this for you. Is this right. my I already copy? got my copy. Okay, you can leave, Zach. All right, how long is it going to take you to do the dismissal papers? Oh, yeah, he got he threw a fit the other day, America, and tore up the paper because he knew he wasn't going to make no money off me. He's harassing and attempting to collect, but I stopped him. <coughs> they had a whole bunch of road tickets on me. One man was held in jail for 20 days over a road ticket, third offense DUI, he wasn't even driving while, yeah, third offense driving on a suspended license, he wasn't even driving. The state pig that pulled up did not even pull us over. We were broke down on the side of the road. And the man that was in jail for 20 days was directing traffic around the broke down vehicle on the side of the road. Somebody, some city fool called and said we'd wrecked, and that ain't true. And they dismissed his charge. He should get paid for that 20 days in jail, $20,000, for their ignorance of law.